messed up. But uh, I can tell you that when people are looking out there and thinking, well, why hasn't the fault lines in Los Angeles erupted? Why hasn't Yellowstone exploded? Why hasn't Elenin smashed into us? And why haven't we all been killed by some death ray? Um, I'd suggest to you that there is an active intervention spiritually now, the likes of which we have never seen in any time in the history of our civilization, and that the spiritual forces are doing what I always hoped and prayed they would be doing. So things are happening beyond our sphere. And look, I'm not saying that the fault line won't go. I'm not saying that there won't be a tsunami or that there may not be you know, changes, earth changes all around us. But we're not alone. No. And we've got a lot of force around us. We've just got to stick to our knitting and do what we're supposed to do. Yeah? That's right. We just do what's in front of us and everything else yeah. will come to fruition. Yes. Exactly. Greg, thank you. And with that, Greg, I'm going to uh, mute you and we're going to uh, thank you. We're going to wrap up now. I want to thank every, each and every one of you for coming on, those that are on tonight live and those that will be listening to this call later. Again, this is for all of us. This is an open source model. And if there are things that annoy you and frustrate you, then you truly do have the power and you have the right to, with others, look to improve them and improve this. Thanks very much to all of you. And I look forward to speaking to you at the same time next week. And thank you and good night. God bless.